a Zoom app that will help your events be more interactive. Hi, Taylor here, Financial Potion, where video is your financial potion. And to never miss out on a video, please make sure you subscribe to our channel and then click on that bell so you're notified every Friday at 5 p.m. Arizona time that a new video has been posted. For one-to-one -one training or just for our content, please click above and connect with us on our Patreon page. It's so hard sometimes to keep people's attention, especially when they're online. There's polls that you can do, but people do love quizzes. There's some competition involved and the knowledge aspect that can be a lot of fun. And so Zoom does have an app called Kahoots, which is a fun, interactive, game-like trivia opportunity. And so in order to download that app, you do need to access it through the desktop version of Zoom. Once you have it downloaded, you can go over to your apps button on the bottom toolbar and then look on the right-hand side for Kahoot. It's a hoot. <laughs> and then when you get into Kahoot, you first need to log in. So this is where, again, having facilitators do some of these things on the back end can be really beneficial for you and your event because sometimes things take a little bit long to do. And if you're the main host having to entertain everyone and keep people talking and keep people engaged while things like this are getting set up in the back end, you might need to do that. But basically what it's actually doing is it's opening up zoom again on a browser and then once it's opened on a browser it's going to then re-show you here on your zoom application so make sure you do have access to your browser to let the two communicate then under discover you will see that there are just different top picks of different topics and different trivias you can do already. Perhaps you're having an event about credit. You could just go ahead and choose the managing credit quiz that they have on there. Um, they have a lot of different topics on here, but maybe you want something very specific to you and your business and your industry. You'll see here that you do have a library. Our library is currently empty. So on the browser, if you log into Kahoot, you can go ahead and create your own Kahoot. You would go ahead and simply click on plus, and then it's going to give you some different options of types of Kahoot games and quizzes you can create. And so you could go ahead and let's just do a product knowledge training over here. You can then pick different stages, different images to add um, and adjust the slides in order to have the questions that you want asked there. And so it's almost like your own PowerPoint creation, gamification opportunity, all put inside of this system. And then once you save it, you can press save and it's gonna go ahead and be in your library as an option. And so I, at the time of this recording, have not used it in an event just yet, but it's something I'm starting to dive into. And I think it's a very cool opportunity that people should know about just to keep that engagement high, to keep people interested and interactive. So I have a feeling I'll be using it in an actual event very, very soon. And if you've used it already, I would love to hear your comments about what you think of this system. Is it something that people have really liked? Have you really liked it? Let me know your thoughts. And if you have any questions about Zoom facilitation or live streaming or virtual events in general, please reach out to us. We're more than happy to help.